check this out guys, I have a badass 2015 Z28 Camaro. These were a two year limited production run. This one is a single owner car with just 9,100 original miles. Take a look at this thing. This car is hot. In fact, it is so hot, Chevy called this color red hot. Uh, and it definitely suits the car. I don't know what other color you'd call this red, but it is gorgeous. I walked around it, immaculate condition. Uh, I did not find a single blemish anywhere on it. Uh, this thing is sitting with the Z28 ground effects, the wider rear quarters and front fenders. We have these amazing forged aluminum 19 inch uh, gloss black Z28 wheels. Those are exclusive to the Z28s. Uh, same with the high rise rear spoiler or rear wing on it. And then obviously the gloss back, gloss black diffuser underneath the bumper here. Uh, the badging subtle, keeps it true to its name, Z28. They even eliminate the Chevy emblem in the center of the trunk area. Now these cars were made to be lightweight, track orientated, so they really stripped them down. Uh, this is the car that you'll get the power to weight ratio out of. They made these only for two years, guys. This was a limited production run. Uh, they made tons of ZL1s, and this car cost more than a ZL1, so not a lot of people bought them. Now take note of the massive brake on these. They do have the Z28 emblem on them. These are a carbon ceramic brake from the factory. If you order these on like a Z06 Corvette, uh, they cost upwards of $8,000. These were an added option uh, straight from the factory. So you did not have to option for those. Coming to the front end, best part of the car in my opinion. We have the lightweight aluminum uh, hood with the carbon fiber insert on it, reducing the air. It also helps with the airflow. Take a look at the Chevy bow tie. It's cut out, allowing the most air to go through uh, to keep this engine cool as you're racing it on the track uh, for that matter. And then this massive front splitter to keep the downforce on the car, keep the car to the ground. It's gonna track amazing. This has some of the best suspension technology uh, that is offered to this date. Now inside the interior is immaculate, of course, 9,100 original miles on it. Uh, it, ex it looks exactly what you would expect. Still looks and smells like new in here. Uh, now these Z28s, they weren't loaded with options. We have the original window sticker here. Uh, you were given two options that you could add to this vehicle from the factory. That would be the air conditioning and the audio package. So this car does have it and dealer installed premium carpeted floor mats. Those were your only two options that you could add, uh, but luckily for you, this car has the air conditioning and the premium stereo in it. So you can cruise this thing uh, or romp on it and still have your AC blasting and your best tunes jamming. Now they did give you Alcantara suede throughout here, uh, but they lightened the weight reduction in here. So they put plastic lightweight inserts in the door panels uh, and they got rid of unnecessary trim that was in the standard Camaros or the ZL1s or other trim styles. Uh, you do have factory Z28 Recaro uh, electronic tilt bucket seats in here. So these are very comfy, but they're still race orientated or race styled. Uh, but you could take this on a road trip and still be comfortable. Uh, in the center here above the shifter, you have again, two options, kind of like an on off switch. You got sport plus mode and your touring mode. So whether you want the suspension to be more or less aggressive, that's at the touch of your fingertips right in the center. And then we have the four pack auxiliary gauges, true to like the older 69 uh, Camaros, that generation, the first gen, the second gen. Uh, so that's kind of neat that they brought it back in these later fifth gens. Uh, but other than that, it's pretty simple in here, guys. Let's move on to the rest of the car. Take a look at the trunk area, guys. Now, if you're thinking that it's missing some pieces, think weight reduction again. Again, Chevy did away with all the trunk liner in here. Uh, so it's all the bare metal, but it's painted nicely still in the red hot gloss red color. And again, clean as a whistle, 9,100 original miles on it. Uh, however, the original owner added a nice WeatherTech uh, all weather floor or trunk liner in here, just so that there's something and it's not bare metal exposed like it would from the factory. And then under in the trunk well area where the spare, spare tire would go uh, is actually the battery. So. Again, lightweight, there's it's very simplistic, nothing to it, uh, but that's okay, because this isn't the car to roll around for luxury, this is the car you roll around uh, for smiles and to bang gears in.
Now we brought this beast outside so I can let you guys hear it purr. Obviously from the startup and the rev and you hear the chop of this car, it's not stock. Uh, it does have the original 427 LS7 uh, engine in here, but with some goodies added. So the heads have been upgraded. The valve train system in the heads have been upgraded uh, to handle the power. It put down 540 rear wheel horsepower, 492 pound feet of torque. That's on a Mustang dyno. We have the dyno sheet here along with uh, the service receipts for all the stuff that was done where this car was built out of the performance shop. Uh, this also has a very nice uh, Air Force MSD intake on it, 102 millimeter Nick Williams throttle body. So only the best of the best parts were used. Uh, and then we have Dynatech long tube headers into the Dynatech stainless steel exhaust. And follow me, listen to this chop on this car, this exhaust note, it's absolutely amazing. This is the best sounding car in our showroom. Right, guys that was my impression on this badass 2015 z28 again one original owner 9100 original miles on it they only made these for two years uh, they didn't make a whole lot of them i believe that like 20 or 30 percent of the red hot z28s have already been totaled uh, so there's not many of them left that are out there in existence but arguably this is the best one so if you are interested in purchasing it hit our website, volocars.com, click the buy it now button, secure that deposit, puts a hold on the car. We can set up financing, it's super easy. We can also get this shipped all, all over the country, nationwide. Uh, how sweet would this thing be backed into your driveway instead of my concrete pad here? So if you are interested, take a look at it at the, on the site. Uh, and if you do like our videos, make sure you subscribe. Jay and myself, we handpick all of these cars that come into the museum. We try to bring you the best of the best and I highly consider this one of the best. Thanks for watching.